Good afternoon, everyone. It's Friday, April the 22nd. I got 315, 68 degrees. It's a nice day out. I wanted to come down to the lower end of Jenny Lynn. There's another building. It's already tore down. But the uh, machine is still sitting on the property. I wanted to catch that and uh, over where H&H &H Fish was. I think that building is tore down now. Figured I'd try to catch it on video. And I'm told when I come out of my house that there's been a shooting down at the Palisades or by the Palisades. When I came out of the house up there, there was a helicopter flying in a circle. I would think that that would have been a news helicopter, but I don't see it now. This is Union Avenue. And as I said before in one of my videos, I, hey, they finally tore this house down. There was one right here that was a literal mess. The roof was caved in on it for a few years. Yeah. Hard to believe there used to be homes over here. Yeah, there used to be homes here. I remember them. Look at that set of stairs to nowhere now. And I still hear the helicopter, although I don't see it. I don't know if the camera will catch it or not. I just don't see it. I figure give it a few more years, Jenny Lynn Street here will be void of homes like so many other places are. Everybody's moved out. Can you hear the helicopter? I don't know exactly where it is, but I hear it. I hear its blades. I'm going to have to go around and come up the other way for where the home was tore down. Because it's down the end of Jenny Lynn Street down there. I'm trying to keep the camera upwards. Maybe the camera will catch the helicopter that I can hear and not see yet. And I've asked this before. Are any of you old enough to remember when Galen and Jones Chrysler Plymouth was right there in front of me, that parking lot? That was Galen and Jones Chrysler Plymouth. Oh, this is bad of me. I can't even think of the name of the street. And I've lived here all my life. The 
built some newer homes here a few years ago. Does anybody remember the big church that used to be on this lot over here? Long, well, I don't think it's been too many years since they tore it down. And as for this parking lot, I don't really remember whatever buildings might have been there. I just remember it being a tarred parking lot. And there's the board on the Moniac building where the car drove into it a couple of weeks ago. Anyway, coming up to the lower end of Jenny Lynn where I'm told there was another building tore down. Uh, and I see it. And all that's left is the rubble. I don't know what block number this is, but... Another building bites the dust, huh? And the track hoe is still in there. They wonder why I call my town the ghetto. Home's gone. And they've got some newer ones built here and here. This building here was the YWCA when I grew up. Still has the name on the front above the door. And now I think it's woman's place and a clinic. But I want to get over to H&H &H Fish, or at least what might be left. I got told they were tearing that down. come back out the same street again and it's a shame I cannot think of the name of this street for the life of me there's not even a street sign up for the road name I call it mental block up to Shaw and see the Shaw name sign is there but there isn't any for the street that I'm on and I just can't think of it okay this is sixth come on left in here okay well, here's you no know, the equipment's here what do you want Jeep I take it this is what was tore down 
Wow. And this Jeep is in behind me. I guess I'm in their way. Wivig, the building is still here. And there's some of the equipment, I guess. Michael Brothers. And the old uh, train tire for the trains when the trains used to come through here. I remember when R.A. Foster and Son was the Greyhound Depot here in McKeesport. They used to pull Greyhound buses into there. I remember when this church was built in the 70s. And boarded up buildings in Moniac. I'm just going back around the same way because I went through it pretty fast. And I know I did. Locust. Just saw the sign, Locust. I could not think of the name for the life of me. the other side a little bit. I got traffic in behind me. Trying to stay out of everybody's way. I'm surprised there's traffic down here in town. Value Finance. Wasn't that City Finance at one time? Okay. Don't see any more cars yet. But that's where H&H &H Fish was. Kind of leaving that roof up there, aren't they? Wow. Okay, I'm seeing police cars down there with their lights running. The old Masonic Temple. Looks like I can make it across. And they had to put stabilizers in the whole deck or all jump. Hmm. Road closed. Probably due to the shootings. Yeah. I can go in and swing through Striffler's lot. Road closed. Fixture in town, Castor was. I don't know who got shot, but when I got told up where I live up there on that hill that there was a shooting down, down, they said 
at the Palisades. But then again, I don't know. At, by, I don't have a clue. There's Legion Arms. Do any of you all remember when that building was Keys Distributing? I do. And when that was... Wasn't that the Ford dealership a long time ago? You'd pull your car into that opening there and hit your horn and they would put the door up for you to go in. And the people's building now. The old Murphy's. I know I've asked this in a few of my other videos. Does anybody remember when that was Pappin's restaurant? Not a car. A couple of cars behind me are in more of a hurry than I am. Yeah. It was supposed to be the saving grace of McKeesport, Midtown Plaza. Odd, isn't it? Yeah. I remember when that was Goodman's Jewelers. security office. Cars up behind me again. Social Security Administration. Want to get into our new transportation center. To me, it's just a big parking lot. But, this is called the new transportation center. In my opinion, I mean, yeah, we need a place for the buses, I understand that. But in my opinion, it's nothing but a big parking lot. Tire shop closed, state's tire building's there, they're gone. Hey, 
Yeah, they do have benches over there. Wonder how many millions of dollars this cost. Okay, there is a police car here too. Yeah, they took the building completely out. Back when National Tube was here, I'm hoping I can get to about the right spot. Probably somewhere on this side of the of the side street there, there was an underground tunnel that went down under here and under the tracks into the old national tube. Hey, we got flyers. Daffodils. Tulips. Yeah. And more down that way. I remember when Amtrak and Port Authority used to uh, have trains that come in through here. I rode Port Authority in and out of here many times in 10 years. Pet train. Numbers of bus. West Mifflin Garage. This one too, West Mifflin Garage. Let's see what the little building has. I think the only people a lot in there are the bus drivers and stuff. There's no doors that say men and women on it. Yeah, I'm standing right now where the tracks were for uh, the Pat train and Amtrak to come through. This is progress. It hurts to walk. Got light, two of them. This is our new transportation center.
legs are hurt. And Echo Star came into there for a while. They weren't here too long. It's supposed to be our RIDC park. I wish they would have zoned it commercial instead of industrial. Smithling Garage and West Smithling Garage. McKee's Port Benches. I gotta sit down. Oh, oh well. Y'all take care out there. And we'll see ya. in McKeesport to view anymore. Take care, folks.